Do you also optimize the routes from which areas to pick up and from which areas to drop? So do you also do that with machine learning and artificial intelligence and try to optimize that as well? And to what extent have you optimized that? So that's, I think you're hitting the nail. That's precisely is our moat, right? The planning stage. Now suppose I want to today deliver 1000 orders, aggregating to 100 tons of cargo from Bhivandi across Mumbai. What is the best choice of vehicle? What is the best sequence of delivery? So we have a tool which is called as Optimus, which, mm -hmm. which takes into consideration six variables. Six, mathematically, this thousand deliveries can be delivered in million different ways. Now you have to pick the right choice, which is what we have cracked in house and we have the algo developed. That algo will suggest right choice of vehicle and right sequence such that your cost is the lowest and you don't breach any SLA. Uh, so optimization is what we actually do on day to day basis. Uh, I'll give an example. There's a client for him we're now serving in Lucknow city, right? Okay. Uh, this is for del delivery to Kirana stores. Mm -hmm. uh, earlier, he was spending like three and a half rupees a kg and using almost 30 trucks a day to make deliveries of 25 tons. Mm -hmm. Today, we are delivering for him 60 tons a day. Okay. We're doing it in 30 trucks only. Okay. And the cost has come down to two and a half rupees a kg. So, he saved almost 33% of his cost. Yes. That adds to his profit. Correct. And all deliveries are happening as intended within time. Excellent, excellent. Right. So you are absolutely optimizing everything from manpower to vehicle movement to fuel management to map management to route management and to direction management. Absolutely. In which direction the uh, the load moves. Yes. So it is beneficial at the vendor end. At the same time, it is beneficial at the customer's end. 